All right, this is gonna be a good one. We got a barn burner. We uh, we we actually have a rainmaker uh, here. It's Joseph Ontario. You guys see him in uh, in the uh, rainmaker Facebook group. He's also in tsunami and, and uh, domination, and you see him in the, on the law of implication webinars. We're gonna get him to say a couple words uh, today, and uh, we'll, we'll have another special guest coming over to my place. Uh, I believe Mohammed's on, but uh, I think maybe his webcam is not on. But I think he's on. I'm here. He's well, here. Great. Yeah, your webcam's not on currently. Oh, um, everyone wants to see. Yeah, Everybody I can see, see him. I can, I can yeah, see him. Everybody can see, see, Everybody can see me. I'm having such a weird day. Go to webinar was really strange when, when I started it. Okay, hopefully uh, it all records and everything is great. So um, it is recording, so that's good. Um, let's jump into the uh, today's going to be a really special one. I, I, the next these next two Q and A acceleration webinars are both going to really be something so i've got your you know this is our maps rainmaker roadmap right that that uh michael and, and the guys take you through when you get in your in your members area i want to remind you of it because today we're going to really zoom in on step one and and we're also going to zoom in on the on, on the incredible power of step four of, of really the whole process you're gonna you're gonna see you're never you're never going to see websites or funnels or anything uh, the same after this. Um, Mohammadi and I just got off uh, a groundbreaking um, meeting with uh, uh, you know, some underground um, software designers um, that you uh, very likely probably haven't heard of, um, and that we have something very very special we're going to start revealing today um, about how uh, things are all going to happen, and it's going to be extremely exciting for you. Um, I wish Eric could have been on. Eric was going to be on, but he, uh, you know, started feeling under the weather, and um, we got a webinar tomorrow. And, and also, um, you know, I, uh, Eric is so intrinsically important to this job. But Mike will be here. Mike is really going to be able to fill in the, uh, the dots, and we're just going to uh, try hard to make sure that we have Eric in two weeks because this is you kind of want to think of this as almost like a two-parter, a um, little bit of a cliffhanger. Um, but, uh, but but really, we're gonna we're gonna get you some good stuff today. So you know, just remember, thinking about this personal agency website, we'll get into it. I don't know about the cost of one to ten dollars. We may have to adjust that. You can spend a little bit more and get a lot more. Um, but uh, let me pull something up for you. So here we go. If we click over to um, oh oh, and let's jump into the uh, Fusion uh, Family Facebook group. Um, you know, the uh, Fusion Lab Facebook group. Uh, my my screen is just really messed up. I may have uh, actually just have. Uh, maybe Jason Calori, do you want to take over for me uh, sure. and show the Facebook group? Because I, I, I'm having an issue here. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to show you some of this other stuff. Yeah, some of these uh, sites that I'm, I'm wanting to pull up are not pulling up. This is unfortunate. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna pull this up. Jason, can you screen capture this when I pull it up real quick? Not sure. sure. No. Uh, give me one second. Uh, so so before you take uh, control of the um, uh, of things. Let me find this uh, optic that I made during our meeting with Mojave. Oh, and uh, th there is a, uh, a PDF for you, a commemorative PDF uh, somewhere on this page for you lucky live people. Uh, you get, uh, uh, Cassie's just doing su such a great job with those. I really like them. Uh, so Jason, could you screen capture this? Uh, yeah, I got it. Okay, great. And I'll, I'll ask you to pull that up in a minute. Okay, Jason, you can take control. Thank you. Okay, one second. And of course, I could ask Michael too, but but I uh, figured it was actually going to be it. Oh, because we're going to wind up probably doing some screen sharing with Jason, anyways. Tell me when you got it, and and I'm just going to rely on what you guys are seeing, not what I'm seeing. So, uh, all right, you guys are seeing it. Okay, the, all right. So there's the Facebook group uh, in the pin thread. Please jump in there, um, and uh, and and punch in a hello. We've got a really special group on. We've got Mahomedy on. Uh, we've got Michael Tessalona, Jason Calori. We've got Will Smith from Map Movers. Uh, boy, are you going to want to move some maps after you hear some of the news that we have today. Um, so we got Will Smith and he's reopening map movers for us. So I'm really excited about that. Joseph, we got Joseph, who's both on Facebook and, and in the real world. So now you know he is a real person. Um, uh, so uh, uh, yeah, so welcome to the show. Yeah, I'll, oh, that's a, that, that's a good one, Mahani. I think I will do welcome to the show myself if I can manage to, to get on Facebook. Welcome to the show. Okay. Um, so I'm going to bang this out because we've got um, you know uh, one hour for this. Uh, re special reasons why is uh, you know I'm always on Greg's 2 p.m. Uh, whenever I can possibly help it. 
um, on Greg's 2 p.m. traffic tsunami webinar. Um, and so need to be done by then, but we've got uh, Joseph here and another, uh, another special guest on the way, uh, another surprise guest, and we're gonna have him talk, another Rainmaker. And I'm gonna take the, uh, the four guys, uh, you know, uh, Joseph, uh, our mystery guest, and, and uh, Mohammedy over to uh, one of my favorite restaurants, and we're gonna sit down and, and have a bite to eat, and then I'm gonna rush back to get, get on for Greg's webinar. So we got Kim's on, ET's on, Chris, uh, Chris is on. Yeah, this is gonna be uh, really lights out. These are, these are very special webinars as we're putting together Maps Rainmaker, and as, a, as it's coming together, uh, extremely beautifully. So, um, so, so um, th this is going to be rapid fire. Um, what the what this webinar is going to be about? Uh, y you're um, you're going to have something. We we have six six figure per month agencies that are founded on uh, the the Maps Rainmaker fundamental blueprint. Of course, they're all on steroids. With you know, at that point, with with uh, tsunami and with uh, client funnel domination, uh, the full coaching from uh, from Eric and Michael. Um, but, uh, but, you know, with that blueprint, we have a blueprint and it's real. We have at least six and really the number is much higher, but let's just say six that I know of six figure per month agencies based on this blueprint and others that are flying up in the numbers, flying up in the numbers. Um, and, uh, and yet none of those websites, none, none of those businesses have what we're going to reveal to you today. So this would be like, if you imagine that there was like a pre prequel of some sort to Star Wars and imagine that the Jedi's just don't have lightsabers and they're just kind of, you know, like what mm. do they do? I mean, every once in a while they could do a backflip or, you know, <laughs> shoot a gun or like pick a tree up or something, you know, but like, it, you know, just in terms of the combat, of course we understand and other, and, and they would keep, keep, keep getting shot themselves. Right. Literally they would just get shot. So it'd be like, so if, imagine, um, and, and yet, of course, it would still be great to be a Jedi compared to just a normal guy, right? Of course, right? You would be able to do backflips. You would be able to lift things up and, you know, tell people these aren't the droids you're looking for and all that stuff, right? Mm -hmm. So that's cool. That's cool. I love it, okay? You'd speak telepathically and use the force and all that stuff. Sense great presences, okay? Um, but this is going to be your lightsaber. And and uh, I, I'm, I'm going to circulate a video to all, all the guys that are on here. It's not It's not ready for prime time, but... Michael, Jason, Will, you're going to get to see something that Mahabdi and I recorded earlier today that is going to, you know, go deeper into what we're going to talk about today. But today's going to give you a great sneak preview. We're going to do that. We also have two big news items that are very similar from Jason Calori and Will Smith um, about how much more powerful GMBs are than we really realize. And that's going to, it's all going to be a part of the, the same thing. We've got Michael here. Michael and Eric are doing such an incredible thing for our team uh, in leading this. Eric uh, is taking the full responsibility of quarterbacking uh, the words that go on the first paw, the first full paw. Like you can make, every, we, a lot of people already have a great paw, but we're building these new lightsaber paws today, okay? Um, and w when you see it, you're gonna know you want it. And, and in fact, uh, the guys know a lot about it here and they all want it. Um, so I'm going to, I'm going to burn through this. I'm going to make sure that we have some time at the end for Will to give us an update on map movers. So right at about the, uh, at the, right around the 1250 mark, I'm going to fully hand things over, uh, to Will. And if he wants to speak for three minutes, that's great. If he wants to speak for 10 minutes, that's great. Um, even, even theoretically, if, it, uh, if I had to go with the guys and he, uh, had more questions and, you know, if Jason and, and Will or any of the guys want to go, I just have, uh, a Mahomedy, and I watch well, even Muhammad could stay on for a few minutes because I got to drive over to him. So that takes five minutes or whatever. But um, I, I, I have to leave. Uh, I want. So, OK, so this is a big deal. So, Jason, can you go to Wayback Machine and pull up area 51 lifestylecom circa 2007? So this is this is the first great website that I made uh, The David Mills and I, <laughs> the David Mills and I made saying that I made it is quite a stretch, by the way. Uh, basically, David made it. I, I, I gave, I handed David a, an image, and, and he handed me this website. Uh, image and a bunch of money and, and a bunch of people that could help us. But, but yeah. So you can go to Wayback Machine. You can look up Area151Lifestyle.com. Pull up an early screen grab. Yeah, 2008 is fine. Uh, I didn't uh, make this site in 2007. Now, um, Jason, what, what did websites look like in 2007? Besides this, uh, uh, <clears throat> I guess they, they were mostly kind of like a like a Google Doc or something looking thing. Like, 
just a plain uh, document. I, I don't know. I have a better way to explain it. Like it wasn't much yeah, design. If you're lucky, they were on a white background. But will, if you're unlucky, it'd be on a black background with yellow text and flashing banner ads. Yeah, the gifts and stuff. Yeah. Now uh, it is now uh, 15 years later since since I created this website. Now this website was so powerful that we used it to build an immediate seven-figure business project in the internet marketing space. It was called area51marketing.com. And then this website you're looking at here is a copy and paste of the same exact skin. All we did was change Area 51 Marketing to Area 51 Lifestyle. And we ran a whole another completely different coaching business in the men's uh, dating advice and attraction niche. And it went for a million dollars also. Same year. Nothing to see here. Right? To this day, I would say that this website makes YouTube look like a piece of garbage right now. Like YouTube right now. Can you pull up YouTube really fast? Sure. Like it's basically almost like a Google Doc with random embeds. You know? First of all, you get to the homepage and there's just not a video. They're just, why do they do thumbnails? They don't understand. Like, it's because people are ashamed of their marketing guys. What like on the home page of YouTube doesn't have a video that you can play. Interesting. Yeah, that's a good point. Go to the front page of ESPN.com. Another piece of trash website. In terms of the design of it. Okay. So you're telling me that they can run ESPN, ESPN2, ESPN in Spanish, whatever, but they can't have a front and center video stream of brand new news. No, they look like a newspaper still, right? What year is this? Okay, let me show you now. Okay, so uh, so pop out to Area 51 Lifestyle. Um, it, now, oh, and, and could you open up the Rainmaker members area, Jason? Uh, sure, let me. Uh... And, uh, and we have the Facebook group. Now, if we scan around in our Facebook group, if we scan down the page in the Facebook group and such, then it's very newsy, right? There's a lot of news, it's exciting, right? There's news updates from members, there's news updates from me. We get them from Jason Clory. Uh, a couple of weeks ago, Will, you did that great graphic. We should pull that back up. That was awesome, you know, with the, uh, the, the blinking map locations and everything. Um, so if you go in Maps Rainmaker, if you scroll down the page, Jason, news 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 and the second you get there right you're in the right place and you can watch videos and we can get right into it right no bsing around still organized right but boom we get right into it okay so this is what if we go back to area 51 lifestyle please jason this is a wonderful view uh to go back and forth and it's a little odd but um so this what David and I were trying to do is create a destination website, but a destination website, see, this wasn't, this wasn't the destination that people would go to again and again, okay? But it was the doorstep. It was the, the, the door that you opened up to get inside, right? It was the entryway. And, and what do you see? Like, this is, this is what people would do is, in Eric Victor One Lifestyle's case, we'd have these great videos on YouTube, and we would link back to the site with watermarks and with, and with backlinks and tell people we have more videos like this, but they're exclusive, not just on YouTube, right? And a bunch more in this great free members area for you. And that we had a PDF for you and the PDF would have links and all this kind of stuff that's dope, right? Um, and, and, and by the way, the PDF, once again, would look dope and have big, clear image screen captures of a YouTube video thumbnail and you click on it and go right to a video and play, right? You know, and, and a you know, video page that looked great, um, and usually I would embed them on our site, right? And, and we'd have a mix, some things on YouTube, but a lot of stuff we didn't have on YouTube because of the exclusivity and of course, people's members area. Okay, so remember that this is the gateway page, but our members areas at the time, oh, and can you pull up the PM, uh, PM Now Instagram as well? Instagram.com slash PM Now underscore SEO. Okay, great. So, you know, for those of you who aren't aware, this is a very newsy page that Michael uh, Tesalona has created with Eric Brief. It's incredible. It's a triumph of human history in marketing. 
Uh, there's all case studies of, of air conditioning contractors making 20 grand, 50 grand extra a month, 100 grand extra a month because of because of our maps listings, right, Michael? Great, great stuff. Congratulations. Remember, folks, you can be using these case studies on your sites. You can you can embed them on your site. Say, hey, uh, you know, uh, the same method, same mastermind. This is what we use, and we're going to get into more doing that with Mahomedy. You're going to love it. So if you go back again to Area 51 Lifestyle, what did, what was on the inside of Area 51 Lifestyle? For one, so one thing you see is there's a blog, right? Now don't click on it because I'm sure, but this blog was, we even had a contest to go to the Playboy Mansion from an essay contest. And we sent somebody to the Playboy Mansion, flew them, and it was great, I mean, it was awesome. And we had a great culture. We had a, um, much like we have a Facebook group now, right? Like J Jason, if you pop over our Facebook group and scroll up and down, very newsy, great news items coming up that you see all the time. Right as you go down, uh, as you go through uh, the group or you know, through the homepage, right, just just one news item after another, exciting stuff. Our members put up cool stuff. Right, look at this. How cool is that? Saw those map rank, rank, rankings shooting up. David Blue, right, and it just goes on and on. I did that post last night. We have news. It's exciting. It's a destination, and your website's exciting. So in the same way, how do we make a million dollar business with Area 51 Lifestyle and Area 51 Marketing? It was the same concept. We'd have We'd have very newsy social media, very newsy uh, uh, web web pages with exclusive content, right? We can we jump back over to um, uh, to lifestyle. Great. Um, oh, actually, now's the time. Okay, so the thing to realize is that this website it's not the website, but it was the, it was a gateway to the website. Of course, the web, rest of the website had the same basic look and feel. Um, but we, you know, had different stuff. So we had some text pages or we had pages that were a, a combination of video and text or whatever. Uh, you yeah, know, we get people, uh, remember people can ask questions here. They can share the video. We got lots of uh, sharing going on. Uh, the the opt-in video is something like this. Um, uh, uh, you know, hey, this is Mike Long. I uh, welcome to this website, Area 51 Marketing. Uh, my friend David Mills and I put together this website uh, because we, you know, we are, you know, the uh, Area 51 of the marketing world. We're underground guys building uh, multi-million dollar projects that are replicable, things that can uh, help you change your stars. We have uh, uh, incredible videos inside of doing, uh, us doing what we actually love, uh, money getting uh, over our shoulder. Uh, if you want to see them, uh, click on the uh, red button to the side or the blue link above, enter your email address, go into your email inbox and check it because there's going to be an email in, uh, in there from me with links to everything. Sound fair? Okay. See you on the inside. Okay, so that was what the video was. I mean, almost verbatim, okay? And it was the same thing on the, the uh, relationship advice site. It was just mystery doing it instead of me. Okay, um, maybe I can find that opt-in video at some point, although who cares? Uh, you know, I basically already just told you what it is. So, but, but the point is it's a gateway. And, and so now let's pull, it, pull up our funnel, Jason. Or sorry, my, that, that screen capture image, uh, please, that I asked you for. We're about to get to two big reveals, one, one from Jason, one from, from Will about the power of maps as well, by the way. It's just kind of a double mega, mega lesson today. Yeah, can you zoom that in as much as humanly possible? Perfect, perfect. Yeah, the more the more zoom. We don't need the outline stuff. Like, we don't need j just the, the core image is what we need. There we go. Okay, great. Great. It's a little fuzzy, but great. Thank you, Jason. That's really great. Okay, so uh, the color blocks there. All right, so this is what your paw is going to be. Okay, um, these lightsaber paws. So, so uh, two things about this. When we did Area 51 Lifestyle, that was the year that YouTube emerged. I had already been using live video, uh, just screen capture from 2003 to 2007. But 2007 is when I was like, we're gonna break into live video. And, and Jason, we're gonna uh, talk about an incredible split test result that Jason had with the live video that David Mills reminded me of on your gold site. You had the hologram. Um, and I wanna kind of uh, uh, bring that up. But um, but uh, bots have arrived in a way that's crazy. And we have design partners um, helping us with a, with a bot technology that we're gonna be bringing to you very, very soon. And yes, it includes the ability, you know, like with Smart Engage to, to do some stuff on Facebook Messenger, but that's not what this is about. It's about, um, and, and Mohammed, if you could have that, uh, uh, shoot a link over to Jason Kalori of your most recent demo. Um, that you did the bot demo that you sent over to me. Uh, could you maybe um, Skype it to Jason? Would be ideal uh, for one uh, uh, for for just a minute from now. So we have this bot technology, and and what I want you to think of is the the video and the bot interplay, 
right? Like the video and the bot interacting. Um, and, and discovery forms are gonna be very different. And so just like in 2007, live video arrived and all of a sudden we could, we could meet people. We could look, you know, they could get to a website and I could be not only looking you in the eye, but I could speak to you right away. And that was never really possible before that. I mean, it was narrowly possible. I might've been able to pull off in, in uh, a bit earlier, but you know, we had our hands full. And, and, and really, it, that was more like when I was ready to do it. Um, and, and video was more emerging in people's consciousness. I, maybe I could have been doing it in two, uh, 2005, four or five, maybe, maybe, maybe. I, I mean, the technology was technically there, but boy, we were, we were struggling with it back then. Okay, so your paw is gonna have, um, it, it's, it's based on uh, two concepts. Um, and uh, Michael Tesalona, I, I'd like to have you for this, uh, uh, this part if you wanna pull up, uh, if now's good timing. And if, yeah, uh, right here. Be great. Oh, and your your webcam's on, and I'm not seeing it either, right? Great. Um, all right. And I, I I look like I'm frozen. Am I frozen? No, no. no. I can see both of you. Okay. <laughs> Just look at this. Sorry, I was showing uh, Jason. I'm, I'm like, as this goes on, I'm I'm having less and less of you guys in front of me. It looks like you guys are like all dropping off the webinar, but you guys are all here. Great. I hope this all uh, records properly. So okay. So Michael, um, the Jordan Belfort process is sell anything to anyone. That's not Eric Brief's funnel that you've mastered. Your funnel is step one, qualify, step two, immunize, step three, onboard, step four, referrals, 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 and we'll get into that. Yeah. Michael? Yeah, do you want me to just walk through the process in a little bit, a little bit more detail? Skim yeah, skim it, skim it for people. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, th I think, you know, the, there's there's a, a few things that really stick out to me as, as being exceptionally you know special exceptionally exceptional about the process. Um, one is obviously its effectiveness. You know I remember um, starting out in my agency journey and really feeling like getting SEO clients was hard. You know that was my experience of it. That like oh my gosh this is like a hard thing to do. And um, by really you know, getting yeah what's up Frankie and Glory actually both of them. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. And then by, um, you know, really getting into this process by meeting Eric Brief, like that's when, like that was probably like the biggest aha. I'm like, oh, wait a second. You know, there's a, there's a process that can really make this consistent and easy and fun. And so, you know, that was, that was probably like, you know, the first, the first real, um, you know, paradigm shift for me from getting to know this process. And then as I've worked with Eric, you know, really, you know, uh, really closely, especially in the last 18 months, as we've brought PM now um, to above six figures a month, monthly recurring. Um, what, By the what way, really, another reveal today. Yeah. Finally, over the weekend, $100,000 a month. Michael, you know what? When you win the Super Bowl, they can never say you didn't do it. No one can ever say that you and Eric didn't call your shot. And build a six-figure per month agency. So proud of you guys. Yeah, thank you. It's um, it's it's kind of um, I don't know. I can almost like it's almost hard for me to believe myself because I remember, I remember, you know, um, just getting started, not having any clients, and and what if what I looked at, you know, oh wow, you know, the people who are making 10k a month, and I thought that that was like a nice stepping stone, and then I was really looking up to the people who are making 20k a month, and you know, I remember hitting that and. You know, but the the folks who are making 100k a month, it was like, wow. You know, I mean, how is that even possible? And you know, it's it's it actually is literally just following following this process. And Super easy, what we really? have with um, <laughs> I was gonna say what we have with um, you know, what we have with ClickUp in uh, in Rainmaker, yeah, it, no, that's no. that's what very much allowed it because, you know, like if I was doing this all on my own, if I didn't have like all those processes, and then the other big piece of it is the fact that we don't we really don't lose clients you know um it's it's uh, i was i was talking to eric about this and this is really this is part of the immuni immunize you know and onboarding you know part of this process what are you immunizing them against dinosaurs right we're immunizing them against dinosaurs against every other you know we're immunizing them against themselves also you know, yeah. allowing them to to really understand like you know, here's the expectations and and what that what that results you in. You you do jujitsu and you you wrestle, and you get to the top levels, and you're not ready, you're gonna get hurt. Yes, 
And, and so yeah. part of the immunization process from getting hurt, like if you aren't strong and fat, I mean, it's a mm -hmm. perfectly safe sport if, yeah, especially wrestling, I don't know if that you know how to fall. Easy. Yeah, exactly. Or even jujitsu also. You, you have to know when you're in trouble or when you're but not. Injuries are really pretty rare yeah. for a sport with that much, you'd think. But Contact, totally. a big thing that happens with injury is guys that shouldn't be on the mat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, that's that's exactly that's exactly right. And and it's also about um, you know, like the 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 quickest line I can draw to the agency is, you know, there are some people who should not be on your client roster, you know, or a lot you know, of them. Yeah. And it's also like, like, make sure that the people who are your clients, like they, they know the you program. The you know, they, yeah. When, the, when you find the gems, set them up for success. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, awesome. and, you know, the, this process, it's, it's a real big piece of, you know, setting the proper expectations, really letting them know like what we do that's different. Um, letting them know like, Hey, you know, you're going to get all of these reports from, bs seo companies and you know what to do when that when that happens so it's all of these things that really just and make you, it you, for you to refer and we're and, and what do we mean by referral so let me let me get to that that was wonderful i'm, I'm gonna mm -hmm. keep you on the, the line like i'm mm -hmm. perfect and i want to progress this now so another aspect of the funnel of course as you know we're doing single contractor niche and, and we're going to really understand way more why so uh, you're uh hvac which by the way, if every single Rainmaker was HVAC, you'd all kill it, okay? I'm not saying that everyone should be. I, I would spread out for sure, but it doesn't matter. Like, uh, it's there's so many of these contractor niches, roofers, plumbers, electricians, it goes on and on and on and on. We'll spell that out for you. Now, um, the actual funnel, Michael, goes step one is a setup um, interaction, right? Which might happen over the phone, mm -hmm. where, you, where you're setting up the demo. But in between, we already are doing a value video, right? Currently, I imagine your value video, you, you film it. I have seen them, so I know what your value video looks like. But you film it, you just send people, a, 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 I think our second guest is here. We'll have one in just a second. Um, you didn't close the door, right? Okay, I'm sure you didn't. Yeah, if, 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 if he's here, let him in. Um, okay, so the, the dogs will go a little bit bananas here for a second. Um, Okay. Um, the value video. The value video. You're probably just sending them like a, an email link to a loom or something like that. Yeah. Okay. So now that's going to all change. And I'm going to show you guys a bunch more. So just, just remember that part about the value video for a second. And the Instagram links back to all of it. Okay. Now what I have, the, the notes over to the right about income, dollars per job, SEO minded and where, that has to do, there's a whole laundry list of things that Eric Brief would ideally like to know before getting on a demo or even before potentially scheduling a demo, right? Like if, yeah. it, you know, if the income's too low, if they're, they're uh, if they're, you know, if the electricians, don't, or sorry, if the a, a, uh, AC guy is only getting $150 a job, it's probably not gonna be the right timing for him, right? If he's not SEO minded where he wants to be, uh, he or she wants to be long-term, then it's probably not best to, to, to schedule the demo because it's gonna be a waste of everyone's time. Okay, so yeah, and the now, where is the population of the city that they operate in? You know, right, is it a exactly. big enough city? That's kind of what I mean is you know, understanding that and more. So, so these are these are just examples. This is by no means all of them, but these are four of the biggest ones. Okay, so um, so now let me show you guys, uh, guys and gals, some crazy magic, and 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 then Jason or then the Michael can comment more. Um, so uh. Referrals. So what do I mean by referrals and why did, why did I put like 57 exclamation points? What's a referral? Okay, so let me explain what, are, what I mean by a referral by showing you these four boxes here, these four different colored boxes that are not labeled. Um, they're web pages. These are four web pages that are going to be on every single, every single individual right now watching this is going to have these four pages. I'm not really going to explain much about that last one right now. Um, it's going to take me a little while to explain it because there's more to it, but it's very powerful. I'm um, explaining these three pages. The last page is just going to kind of help you close people that are on the fence and be very convincing. So the first page is your home page and it's your contract page. Now your, your, your website is ranking for like, you know, Lake Placid SEO um, because you did that and that's part of things, but you're a contractor site. So you're doing, let's say electrician. Okay. So here's your electrician page. Here's your um, plumber page, whatever it is. Uh, eight, uh, uh, Air conditioning for Michael, mold removal for uh, for Greg Morrison and Dan Anton, six figure a month agency, and so on. So this page is you're speaking to the contractor. So um, let's say 
let, let's 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 say it's a stretch. Let's say this is Michael's funnel, okay? Michael Tesalon's funnel. So Michael Tesalon is doing AC repair, and let's say that um, that Greg Morrison uh, is uh, the um, uh, air conditioning guy, air conditioning contractor. So this page is for Greg Morrison, the air conditioning contractor. The second page, and, and it you know, says we do a great job. It, it shows case studies from Michael's Instagram, might even show case studies from other Instagrams. You know, this is the kind of work that we do. And everyone here will be able to draw off of our Instagrams. Will be You're going to be putting our posts on your page, and we'll help you with that and make it look great and also help you develop your Instagram. You're going to have an Instagram too. Jason, how do you like having an Instagram? It's awesome. I mean, it's, it's just a place to send people, show them results. It's, it's really convenient. Yeah, Michael, you like it? Yeah, it's it's like the any so much of it is just, you know, can I trust you? You know, what have you done? And it's just it's the best way to respond. Yeah, and, and you'll be able to post our Instagram posts, explain to people honestly that you're a part of our mastermind and that gives you access to our methods and our software, uh, which is awesome. Uh, software and software systems. Okay, so that's the first one. Sorry, yellow page, our gold page here is our uh, contractor page. Then our second page is our first referral secret weapon. Michael, this is either the first or, or very, probably the first time anybody on this webinar has heard it. We've revealed it very, very little. You have one affiliate who paid you how much last month? I think you paid us 44,000. 40 or thousand dollars one affiliate how long did it take us after we figured out the uh single contractor niche funnel michael which took us about a year and a half how long, do you mean, did, it how long did it take to build up to the 40 yeah like, like what no, well once we got to the point see here's here was the progression ladies and gentlemen michael and eric got to around 20k a month with this ac repair business and we started getting leads on potential affiliates uh, let, let's say Will Smith is running a web design co uh, company and um, he's got 40 or Mohammed even would probably be a better example. Let's say Mohammed had, uh, you know, 50 AC repair uh, customers that he's done websites for. Right. Well, he's a potential affiliate that that, you know, Greg Morrison might say, hey, Mohammed, who you, you design my website. M Michael Tesla is killing it for me. I'm making an extra hundred thousand you should refer other clients of yours and they'll pay you a commission, right? Uh, uh, th that, uh, the person who sent you $44,000 made a, a pretty penny themselves, didn't they? Yeah, 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 they made over 5K, you know, profit. Win, 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 yeah. win, win. And, and they're, they're getting customers that are crushing it. You're giving them case studies. We're powering up their marketing. Right. Yeah, we've helped them win deals. They do, they do like only websites and um, they're able to win higher, you know, like more competitive deals by letting them know that, hey, you know, we've got this partnership with this SEO agency who can, you know, offer that service for you. And you're going to be able to uh, use that case study that Michael just outlined. We have multiple case studies of this. It's not the only one. Uh, it's the most impressive, but it's not the only one. Oh, currently, well, there'll be more. There'll be new ones and they'll grow. This blue page is slash your affiliate page. Okay, so you are going to have an affiliate program and uh, you'll explain that affiliate program. We'll tell you how to explain it. Don't Eric Brief is going to do all the writing and we'll we'll even have a done for you service that, that can help you, you know, should you want to do that. And we'll definitely have handholding. So much of Rainmaker is going to be about really nurturing you through this process and giving you every advantage of building this a paw lightsaber because it's going to be life changing. Um, it's going to sound like a lot better as time goes on. OK, so uh, you're going to have that case safe from Michael. You explain how it works and that and this these pages link to each other. And Michael, they prove each other. Um, th that you have affiliates. Yeah. Proves, uh, can you explain? Yeah, no, no, it's it's one of those like circular you're proof one. things. Because you're the Eric Brief of these referrals. You're you're yeah. the one who's churning these referrals, churning these referrals. I, I'm going to run to the fridge and grab myself a, a a water. But could you explain that annihilation engine? Yeah, it, it's it's basically like um, the the first page is you know we're we're essentially we're amazing at SEO, and the second page is um, Hey affiliates, we can you know we can uh, or potential uh, affiliates, we can we can help you you know get a, another revenue stream and um, also help you just look great for your you know your customers who are in the same niche. And the reason why like it works 
with one another is it's like, you know, yeah, we're great. And that's why we have this affiliate program and we have affiliate program. And it's another thing that, you know, helps us get even more of these clients. So it's sort of just, you know, so it, you know, it, it goes round and round. The webinar guys, uh, I, and I'll ask you guys for, you know, cause we're going past the theorists. Jason, if that was the reveal of the webinar, wouldn't this just be the most earth shattering thing? Yeah, I mean, that that's a big deal because by default, we just have maybe just like a service page without that. And yeah. uh, I, I mean, even saying you have affiliates means it works. Like it means you're like at another level past just, hey, we have a service. And you're suggesting so. to people that they give you that referral and training them how to do it. And they have a page now for it. They find they have somewhere to yeah, send. Previewing of it, yeah. Wrap your funnel, yeah. Michael. You, you can send them uh, to, to this page and you can point, you can highlight affiliates that have done well for you, thus getting more affiliates as you speak to your list. Yep. Fighting. Okay. But wait, and there's the more. Incident part, uh, yeah, the yes. incident part about it is that like all those affiliates are real, like are, you know, living proof of the service, you know? Exactly. Exactly. And you've got a, a real viral spread. That's a great point. Now, yep. this third page is where, where uh, things get really crazy. Uh, this page is your partnership page, partnership page. Jason, what did your best, uh, so here's the crazy thing with Jason Glory. Before Maps Rainmaker, you're a great affiliate, you're great at e-commerce, but it just, you hadn't broken through with leveraging the awesome power of Google Maps. Mm -hmm. Now you've broken through so crazily, so crazily. Jason, you've partnered because the awesome power of your Google My Business listings and because you know, you've demonstrated yourself, right? You partnered with some great people. You built two stores or had two stores, took over two stores, however it happened. Power them up with Google My Business listings. In April, how much did those two stores do combined? Uh, just, over, just over 180,000. Do you have that set available handy anywhere? Uh, yeah, let me find it. Hundred eighty thousand dollars a month. A month. Um, but Will Smith, you do this for your own businesses too. You have your own businesses that you're partnered in. You power them up with your own maps listings and right. make money hand over fist. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, it's pretty awesome. Local local SEO is 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 great. It's it's fun. Plus it's technically easier i guess you want to say it's it's um easy way to make money that's awesome jason yeah i, I think i was thinking about the kind of the transition i i, I think it's because it it's felt like a factory like when i first started with it with the rainmaker fulfillment it felt like i was building like this at first it was like a conceptual factory and then there's like click up and, and processes and and people too it's not just all all software it's like semi-automated but you have this factory on your side and then partnerships are easy because people want the output of that factory. Like, yeah. so, so having gotta, like this factory on my side was, was really tasty. That's what got me I got, excited. I got an unbelievable earnings report from, I love that Jason. I got an unbelievable earnings report from uh, Don Whitmore, he's 66 years young. And uh, just, uh, uh, it was in Rainmaker, uh, it is in Rainmaker and, and got up to 10K a month. Congratulations, uh, profit, really proud of him. Um, but, has huge news. He is in tsunami now. Um, I uh, I don't know if he's in domination yet, but but uh, he has huge news, and I'm so excited for everyone to hear this. Um, he's about to get a ninety thousand dollar bonus because he set up a local a, a partnership with one of his top clients. Um, and when he hit, you know, oh, wow. ninety thousand dollar bonus. It's so beautiful. Don, yeah. to the captain, and Don, you did it. You got to ten k a month. No one can ever say you didn't. And when you get that 90K, they can never say you didn't do it. And, uh, and it grows, it grows. You can yeah. show that to somebody else. And the guy sending him 90K is making millions. So it's beautiful. Uh, Jason, can we jump back over to the info or, or my, uh, my website funnel? <laughs> Interesting uh, explanation here. <clears throat> Zoom in as much as you can again, thanks. <clears throat> okay, so the third page, Michael, is your partnership page. And we're gonna be able to leverage Jason's case studies and, and every case study that we can get on that, especially Jason's. Can you explain how this makes the, a whole circuit that's super crazy? Because these initial leads that are coming in as contractors are not just giving you affiliate referrals, but the best ones, 
you can partner with them and you know who the best ones are. Uh, like you and Eric are doing such sophisticated stuff with building out a funnel for us to be able to do this with how the tracking needs to work, how the affiliate stuff mm -hmm. works. Michael, this is such a triumph to be able to explain this, you know, the, this third page, and then I'm going to dive into that, what, the, what your site's going to look like. Yeah, the, the idea is that, you know, as you're able to take, um, I mean, you can kind of, you can take more risk off the table for potential, you know, partners, and you can say like, hey, look, I'm so confident in the system that I have. Well, that, that, no, we would, yeah, and, and we wouldn't do this for um, somebody who you haven't worked now. off of this. Like, you, this would be somebody who's like your best client. So th they would get to scale massively with no risk is what you're saying. Yes, exactly, right. So, so the idea here is, you know, um, you've been working together with somebody, you trust them, you see that they run a great business, you see that, you know, they're getting great reviews, they're, um, you know, they're on the ball. And what you can do is then say, look, as we scale up, you know, I'll take on the risk of the, you know, the marketing and um, you don't need to, to pay for the, the SEO work as we scale, but instead what we'll do is we'll set up tracking so that we know what leads that we collect. And then uh, what's great in this contractor, in these different contractor niches, is there software where you can connect a phone call all the way to the revenue. And so now, you're, you know, you've got, um, now you can actually be a partner in a business at, you know, a business that's growing with the help of your SEO work. And you get to pick the best people and, and use all of our processes. And again, Michael, once again, it proves how great you are at the first thing. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I mean, if you weren't, if you weren't great at the first thing, it'd be impossible for anything like this to happen. You wouldn't want to like take the risk. And um, it also just shows like a sophistication, you know, the fact that, you know how to track this, that you know, um, you oh, know what their margins are supposed to look like. A partner on steroids, Jason, you do it. I mean, you do, you yeah. do email marketing that's extremely powerful, not just for the national, but for the local. You know, we all power up these businesses. We're all like, basically, Michael, this is like having your own franchise, but it's like a meta franchise that where you mm -hmm. can spin it off in all these ways. You can spin it off for clients. You can spin it off for uh, affiliate partners. You can spin it off for real partnerships. It's one of the, mo the most amazing things about SEO is that, you know, using this one skill, you know, you can, it, it really opens up so many different ways for you to make money. And, you know, this is one of the biggest ways. I mean, you have to find somebody that you trust, somebody who can, you know, really do a great job. But, you know, having this skill of being able to put anybody wherever they want on Google, I mean, it's, it's huge, it's just so, so valuable. And the, and the crazy thing is, Michael, having this affiliate stuff and this partnership stuff, it doesn't make you want individual clients less. It makes you want them more. They make, yeah. they literally become even more valuable to you. Yeah, yeah, because, you know, I mean, all of this stuff makes every single client more valuable. You know, the fact that you can keep them for a long time makes them more valuable. The fact that you get referrals makes them more valuable. The fact that they can help you, you know, find affiliates, the fact that you could potentially partner with them. Um, yeah, I mean, it, that's... It, it, it motivates you to do it. Totally. It makes it easy. Yeah, um, yeah, because you realize, you realize like really what's at stake, what's at play, and what the upside is. It's tremendous. Okay, I'm, I'm going to book through this demo and then we're going to uh, bring on our uh, special guests. We have Joseph here. I, I showed you guys earlier. We have a new one who just came in. I'll keep a little bit of a mystery right now. Um, uh, so let's uh, let's have a look. I, someone's saying, is it Tony Robbins? No, come on. It's way more interesting than that. Um, <laughs> come on. This is Matt's Rainmaker, folks. Okay. So um, so now let me show you, let, let me connect some dots here, okay? So we've got these four static pages that you're gonna have. The fourth page is like an FAQ, but it's really good for conversion. I'll explain it more later, it's very important. Um, so you have these four static pages. And, and I, I realize the way I'm gonna do this is I, I'm gonna spend this, this uh, couple minutes uh, quickly um, doing this demo. I promised Will Smith that, that, that he could uh, take command things, but I, I do want, just to have a, a couple words with our, our special guests first, and you guys can probably hang on for a, a few more minutes after I uh, book out of here. Um, it, uh, including, I'd like Mohammedy to be able to, if Mohammedy wants to show about things a little more, pull up a bot demo uh, or with, with Jason Kalori and stuff like that, that'd be really great. Mohammedy can, can speak a little bit about the meeting that we just came off of that was so exciting. Yes. Uh, and and Mohammedy, thanks for doing that. You're, um, and then I'll, Mohammedy, I'll just drive over and pick you up. Okay, um, cool. okay great. All right, so um, so here's how it works. So we got these four pages, but what we also have is our, our meta pages. So I talked about when we, when we pull up um, when we pull up area51lifestyle.com, okay, 
uh, one, one, one last time. So I talked about how that page that you're seeing is that's the gateway to your world. Now, Michael, the first time that they're really gonna see your website is potentially is if they were to click on a link for a value bet. Is that right? Is that right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, they're, they're, you're not likely to say to somebody, hey, go to the homepage, because because that would be a very- we're doing, some, we're doing some outreach, you know, we're sending them an email yeah, or something. You, you yeah, there's tons of ways. You can link to it and you will, and that'll be great, you know, contextualize it. But that value video moment is very powerful. There's a reason that that's a part of the process. You set up the demo, but in between you do that value video and then you do the, de the sales demo, okay? So think of this, imagine that this is your website, you know, area51electricians.com, uh, you know, and I rank for Brickle SEO with it or whatever, okay? Um, and uh, so Michael, you've recorded a value video. I'm gonna give this to him a much more basic form. This is gonna be much more exciting than what I'm gonna explain, but the basic form will be really awesome. So let's imagine that you're doing your demo and you're like, uh, not demo, you're doing your setup call. You're Eric Brief or you're, you're, or you're handling the, the setup call yourself, Michael. So, so you're telling people, you're the person that you're, you know, this Greg Morrison who you're trying to sell HVAC um, uh, consulting to, uh, you're telling them, hey, um, what, uh, you know, what's your, uh, uh, one of the things that's gonna happen is I'm gonna do this value video for you. And the value video is gonna be really great. And on the value video page, the first thing that you're gonna see is my bot, Cassidy. And Cassidy's really smart. She's set up to make it a great experience for you. She'll, she'll reflect back the things that, that, that I learned from you already, right? Like some of the things you mentioned to me, like you're at $300,000 a month right now. Great, congratulations again, right? And she's also gonna collect a few more key data points that we may not have gotten to during this meeting, if she can. She makes the, the whole process is super easy, barely an inconvenience. And, uh, and you can get on, uh, you know, my, my value video will be about five minutes and then you can talk to Cassie as much as you want, but you know, most people, you know, usually talk to her for a couple minutes more. And that allows us to generate you a follow-up PDF that's gonna be awesome, it's custom just for you. Uh, it's gonna help uh, us prepare. Uh, Cassie's gonna help confirm your meeting and that you're gonna be able to make it, uh, uh, set you up, you know, double check the scheduling, and then I'll see you on Friday for our sales demo. Does that sound fair? Okay. Sounds great. Yeah. All right. So that's so that's what you say to the guy. Now, Greg clicks on the link, right? You you prepare the value video. It's it's Wednesday. You're sending him his value video or Thursday or whatever. He clicks the link. He comes to this page. The first thing he sees is the page and Michael smiling and waving to him. Let's say or saying you know click the video link or whatever, right? Um, you don't autoplay it. Um, instead of playing the video, however, what happens instead? Uh, uh, Jason, did Mahadi send you that link where you can click on the, the link in Skype and pull up the demo he made? Yeah, I sent yeah. it to you over. Yeah. Right here, okay, don't, don't exit that, don't exit that. That's my exact point, perfect. Okay, so imagine, so this is the gray screen pop-up and it happens when you when you scroll up. Oh, I see what you're saying, yeah, why don't you refresh and, and, and respawn this uh, so yeah. people can see the action of it. Refresh? Yeah, and I don't know if it spawns every time or if you have to do it, a new link. So when, when, when Jason goes to exit, it, it, it does a certain kind of uh, pop-up that's a gray screen, perfect. So imagine that Greg Morrison just got to your Area 51 lifestyle site, and, and for, a, a, for a split second, you saw Michael's video, which is there. But first, before the video plays, this gray screen pop-up comes in, and the, this middle bot is the exact dimensions of the, of the video, right? Mm -hmm and Cassidy's talking to you. She quickly acknowledges, hey, Greg, I'm so glad you made it over. Um, I'm gonna play the video for you really quickly. Uh, you know, uh, uh, we'll confirm a couple facts and we'll get you going. Um, you know, so I'm gonna play the video and then I'm gonna, uh, I'll, I'll pop back up at the end and uh, you know, we'll, we'll confirm your schedule. And if you've got more questions, boy, do I have answers for you, okay? So then they watch your value video, as always, you explain great stuff. At the end, Cassie's like, here are the three biggest points, you know? Now I see that you are at 300K a month. I see that, remember I had those lists of, could you pull up that, that the, the funnel demo again really quick, Jason? And I, I'm, I'm basically uh, completed, but I'm telling you guys, this is freaking awesome. Um, so over uh, upper right, it says income, uh, dollar per job, SEO minded, where? 
Uh, that's what Cassie's doing. It's a tuning. Yep, we got your income. By the way, didn't catch, catch how much you're, you're getting for, uh, for job. And of course, if they want to exit out, they can. And if they're curious about something, and Michael, and they want to go down the rabbit hole, you can have FAQs and other videos. Yeah. Oh, you want to know about more about our affiliate program. You want to know more about how SEO works. You want to know more about expectations, how long it takes. Duh, duh, duh. They can spend three days talking to Cassidy if they want. To. That's I mean, crazy. Okay. It's, it's crazy. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mother and, effing show. And you know, just talking about the referral, right? Imagine like somebody click, oh, you want to learn learn more about John that just, you know, closed this amount of client and got five thousand yeah. dollars on the referral. Oh, program. yeah. You, and yeah. you upload a video of John super excited. It's like <laughs> Amazing. You know. Amazing. Um, all right, I, I, I'm, I'm going to introduce our, our guests, uh, special guests, and then we'll turn things over to Will and then uh, and then Mahadi, if you have any final notes but before you come down and meet us. Um, so let me get, uh, you already met Joseph a little bit first, so, so let me bring Frankie over. Um, much more interesting than someone else like Grant Cardone. No way. No way. We got, we, 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 going we, 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 we got, we got right, Frankie. How's and, it going? Uh, Michael, you got a very special relationship. You and Eric had, had developed a very special relationship, not just with Joseph, but also with, with Frankie. Um, Frankie, you've got huge news. So you joined uh, Rainmaker in December. Um, you, you have a, a great backstory. You actually were working for Grant Cardone and, uh, yeah. and Frank Kern. Um, <laughs> and uh, they, they, they imploded. Yeah, yeah, their agency totally, um, during COVID, they just totally shut down. Everybody got fired literally almost overnight. And, and so you, Shocking. So you, were, so you were a very shy customer service person. By the way, the only marketing that their agency apparently did uh, you know, by Frank Kern's design was um, uh, marketing to people that, 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 that they're doing something when, when people weren't getting results, which is sad. But anyways, um, so you got in on the process, you know, you're just getting started. Uh, I got a new earnings report from Eric that he told me about you. I was so excited. Michael is so proud. Where are you at now? I've literally doubled since we last spoke. So I'm over 20K now, uh, just off SEO, fine SEO. Yeah, it's awesome. You know, if you win the Super Bowl, they can never tell you that you didn't win the Super Bowl. You did that fast, Frankie. You did that real fast. Less, fast. Than, less than five That's months. Phenomenal. Got, yeah. his, got yeah. his niche and, and, and his shoot, uh, uh, shooting up. Frankie, um, you, uh, we, we have some great training inside of Rain, Rainmaker. And I want to point out, if you uh, uh, folks, if you'll go back to the um, the great workshop that we did with um, Eric, uh, uh, that, that's a little bit below your latest news feed. We, we had this really great interview that, that uh, Eric did with very carefully with uh, Frankie beforehand, and we took these great cuts from it. So you can learn a lot more from Frankie in your, in your members area. But my favorite part of that was how you talked about how you feel like doing sales and stuff, you felt anxious. And, but now, you know, when you're funneling uh, Eric and Michael's way, I mean, you just cackle with joy. <laughs> yeah, it's it's literally it comes natural. It just comes out like I genuinely want to talk to them. I genuinely want to learn about their business. They, you know, they genuinely feel that, and it's not like I'm trying to be salesy. Or I'm trying to use all these techniques and whatnot. Like it's and you learn those techniques. Process. That's not sour grapes, right? Like they taught you all of those techniques. You know, by like what you know, with the you know the supposed conversion masters, right? Um. I don't have I don't have beef at all with uh, uh, Grant. He's smart enough to uh, uh, to to hang out with Muhammad. So that that's pretty cool as far as I'm concerned. Uh, uh, jo Joseph, you want to you want to hop in here for a sec yeah. and uh, uh, just say a couple words, and then we're gonna hand things off to Will, and then Muhammad can say whatever he wants, or any of you guys can unpack things any way that you want. So um, you know, how do you like how do you like being our orbit? I'm just gonna like let you. Let me I love out. it. I love it. This is my ultimate dream. Is to run one of these webinars. But I didn't know you joined in December. 2020? Yeah, for the funnel, funnel domination. And yeah. that's the first you ever heard of this community? I've heard well, of he it. Walked up, he walked yeah. up to me. He yeah. knew my aunt. He knew, but didn't even. But how much SEO experience had you had before you joined? I, I had a bit, but I wasn't at the OMG style. You know, like I didn't. That's when I really, everything elevated from there. But okay. I have been dabbling with it. Before. Yeah, so when I started, I started a little bit after Michael Tessalona. When we started, you guys had. Greg Morrison, we had the Over the Shoulder series, we had Fletch, yeah. Floyd, we had Joe Marfolio. I used to do the assimilation light webinars, and my goal was to get to 10K a month, right? Mm -hmm. And he just did it. He just joined in December. I've been yeah. doing it since 2017. Yeah. 
Well, we're so systematized. Now. It's that now it's like a step by step exactly. Then you can pick the niche exactly the links you have to build. I mean, you have the software to yeah. build it. Like yeah. it's literally A to Z how to make money, and it doesn't exist anywhere else from from my experience. I mean, I've been doing this for five years, and I'm I'm genuinely shocked. I didn't know Frankie's results. I didn't know when he joined. I've been in this for five years. I'm not at 20k a month now with SEO. So, but overall, you're doing well. No, I'm doing fine. I mean, look at the me behind me. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. I, I, I gotta find the Rolls Royce on me. All right, ladies, ladies and gentlemen, that, that's our part. Um, uh, so, so uh, Frankie, uh, Joseph, and I are gonna uh, jump in the the, the Rolls Royce on paid with from uh, SEO clients, and we're gonna pick up a homily. Uh, but, but that'll take at least five or ten minutes, and we're gonna zip over to uh, a, a local restaurant, uh, have a have a bite to eat. And uh, you know, uh, guys, uh, you guys can uh, stay on this webinar as long as you want. What I'm going to do, um, I'm not going to end the webinar, or I'm not going to leave the webinar because that can cause all kinds of problems with the recording and stuff. So just basically, Jason, why don't you just be um, uh, responsible for ending it? And just as long as it ends right. before 2 p.m. before Greg's webinar is the only thing I ask. All right, guys. Okay. Peace. Okay, cool. Be on it. See you guys later. Later, I'm going to say a couple of words. Uh, lightsabers, lightsabers. You guys are going to be building lightsabers. Who needs? Who we'll needs watch it? them put the addition on your, your building. What's that? We'll watch them put the addition on your building. Is that what they're oh, doing there? God, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no I'm getting a new place. It's, yeah, you, my sweet crane. All right, guys. See you, uh, <laughs> the rest of the replay. That's that's amazing, you know, to see like yeah, people cool. like a clear cut of how <laughs> things was back then and how things are now. It's just like super different, you know. Like Jason yeah. and Will, you guys have been like there since like in 2016, or along with you know Michael Tessalona. It was like compared to what we have today, it's just like a no-brainer. Yeah, having no a whole brainer. system. I mean, before, I mean. You could rank, but having a system yeah. to onboard clients and and um you know just everything systematized, which is really cool. It, it makes it and, and really the crazy simple. thing. About, yeah, and the crazy thing about it back then, it wasn't like measurable. Like if you get a client, you know we can rank anything, right? But you don't like you don't have like a structure. Is like okay to like tell somebody, hey, this is how you know we're gonna rank it's like approximate like oh between six to twelve months six to nine six or nine months we have three months yeah. window and you're like okay just send links here so like different things and like not a consolidated plan as what we have today and that's yeah. like you know makes all the difference it does and what you really have good. here will it's just like an extra and it's very powerful and before we haven't really like mastered it the way we have now with you on yeah. board with my moves. Yeah. Know what I noticed? The couple, th uh, one thing that I noticed, um, speaking about maps, mm -hmm. is um, a lot of, a lot of, um, not a lot, but a good amount of websites on, you know, your clients' websites, whatever. Um, the actual, so, you know, there'll always be like a map or something, mm -hmm. but it'll just be like a general map address. Um, yeah, people should really be embedding the Google My Business map on the website and have that whatever whatever page you have it on. If it's a contact us page or the home page or the footer, have one of those pages optimized for the keywords you're trying to rank for. Yeah. Um, it makes a difference, you know. Oh, and then wow. if you can embed it other places too, you know. This is like this is, this is like one of those gold nuggets that you know yeah. you offer. Nah, yeah, you should be done. I mean, about, it just right? makes sense too, right? Like, why wouldn't you have a business location? Even, well, if, it's a, even if it's a service area business, it still helps. Yeah, um, why, why wouldn't you? Oh, wow, that's a gold I, nugget there. I have a couple of animations to share. I don't know if you guys want to see them. Oh, yeah, yeah definitely. Go ahead. How do you share the screen? Uh, it's at the top yeah. right under sharing. Oh, oh and you sharing. Can make it, you, I, can, okay. I can hand it to you. Hand it to him. Pretty much. Should pop up. Screen? Yep. Yeah. Let me see. I'll move this over. Right, yeah. And Can I'm you gonna see, start. Um, oh, am I sharing the wrong screen though? I no, see. Uh, I think Flipper. we see join thirty six thousand Flipper. Facebook or no? Flipper. Not, no. Uh, right Flipper now right we see now. Flipper. Mm -hmm. Oh, I gotta change the screen, huh? Oh, there we go. There we go. 
So here's one. I, I, I can you see it now? Yeah, I can see. I see a map with uh, colors changing. With the animations. So this one, um, I can't really give away the keywords or anything, but um, you know, you can see it's not even showing the dates actually. But these, there should be a date thing here. But you can see where we started, um, and this is a combination of, you know, optimizing Google My Business and then you know having interactions like with Map Movers. Um, so what Map Movers does is, you know, we start close to the location. And um, just imagine someone on your cell phone interacting with that business, um, going past all the other businesses, and then we move out from there. You know, so, so, we, so the red was uh, when it started. I guess it'll flip back it started, this, yeah. right there. And yeah. this is showing like a grid over an actual map of where that yeah, business every, ranks. It scans every. <coughs> excuse me. I every, really like every, this report. Yeah. Every two weeks, they're cool to show you, show you clients too. This isn't my soft like the map movers is my thing, but this is local Falcon, um, which which does some cool um, animations like that. Here's another one. Um, this one popped really quick. Um, this is in the United States too. Both of these are in the United States, but oh, the animation. Uh, how many um, how many miles is that? Like, so you, you run map movers. I have some this stuff is, set up on map movers uh, with you. And like, yeah, how many we measure like miles every, is this set up from the business? This is a 10 mile radius. 10 miles, okay. Um, yeah, we just, I mean, we could take more data points. <laughs> yeah, this one's so quick. So they were like, uh, I guess we'll wait for it to flip back. Yeah, just um, wait. So yeah, they would, so they, they, were they were like, where they were, and then, so they weren't the even in the three pack, and then it's like, bam, right up to number one, the three pack all across the city. Yeah, I think they were the three pack, they were number one. Yeah, so they're number one when they started. And then, um, yeah, just expanding that reach, which is another thing, like, it's great for a client to get get more of that. Yeah, well, I've, had, I've had some questions about map movers. Could you explain kind of the gist of what it does? Like, what, um, so I give you one of my GMBs, you put it in map movers, and then like, what happens right after that? So right after that, um, like the onboarding process, we, we um, yeah, you grab, you get like the uh, address and the keywords on rank four, yeah, and then yeah, like, we get the yeah the yep. location, the keywords. You have like that big server that you've been upgrading, upgrading ever since you started this. Like what's yeah, happening got, on that one, server? One actually, I don't know if you can see it. I have two, but there's one right behind my head. That one, um, and that's where the team works off of. But so map move is is like so people. One thing I think like a misconception is people think like, oh, um, we got to like for local anyway, like if you're doing like search and click or something like that, um, the IP address matters. It, it really doesn't because like if I if I search from my phone, um, like if I if I visit like my own website, it, I'm in, I'm I'm south of Boston. It shows that I'm in Connecticut, like always for my IP. So cell phone IP is a kind of a weird thing, right? Because who knows mm -hmm. where the, the, the data center is or anything like that. Um, so it goes off a of GPS. And so that's what we do is we put searches, the real people that are doing the searches, it's not a, not bot traffic or anything like that, in the location. You know, so we, we have a cell phone and, and it's in that location of really multiples, you know, multiple cell phones. Um, doing searches and clicking, but not just that. It goes further than that, where it's interacting with the listing, um, looking at reviews, um, opening the dialer. So, I mean, we and we are also on those sheets. You can request like, oh, we don't want to open the dialer because we're using that mm -hmm. track calls um, and um, upvoting. We don't leave reviews or anything, but we upvote reviews, look at images. So. Doing all the optimization is really important because if it's just a blank GMB, there's really nothing to interact with. So that's why it's important to go through like the steps, you know, in Rainmaker and, and optimize mm -hmm. the listing and things like that. Um, so, so you ran it, you run your GMB through Rainmaker fulfillment, and then uh, like Omar uh, Rainmaker, uh, I told you about his uh, his restaurant, his brother's restaurant in Barcelona. Um, which Mohammed helped set up on Smart Menu, but it also has a GMB. And you can just, I guess by default, you can just kind of leave the GMB the way it is and hope that people crawl around it 
and do all the stuff you're saying. Or in map movers, you have like actual people that will uh, kind of like log in from these locations, these like zip codes we see on the screen, and they crawl around the thing, look at the yep. menu, see what's what's for um, what, what there is to eat today, look at the daily specials, click on the phone call link, and Google is like, hey, this must be a great business. People are like digging it, yeah. digging. This one was in the twenty what twenty plus or something, which is probably like page three of uh, page two or three of the GMB not in that little map pack and <laughs> right what map mover is just like crawling around it and then google's like hey this needs to be at number one yeah it just shows more relevancy right like you show more relevancy like and it just moves it i like before like you could do like you could do it almost in a day or actually in an hour i've, I've seen a move in an hour where you know i was at a meeting or something and i'd say hey you know everyone just search for this guy's not his business but search for what he does like a roofer and um you know, just click on it and look at it, and you know, within an hour it would pop up there. That kind of stopped. It, like I think Google kind of caught on to that like big surge. So now you know we've we've actually like like decreased the amount of people searching at, mm -hmm. in one session and increased the frequency of it. So it's just more times per day, um, and that yeah. really seems to be working, working really good. I mean, this is something. I mean, you can do yourself. Like if you're networking and and you ask people to search, it will, it will work. Um, yeah, didn't you tell me just, that uh, when you were first explaining this before I got onto it, you, you like were at a was it like a BNI or something? You were yeah, at, that's right. Uh, the the you, you were like, hey, everybody, search yeah. my uh, my business, and yeah. that's that's basically what this is. It's like, hey, yeah. everybody, search. Yep, so, everybody, search. Um, that doesn't seem to work as great anymore. Like those big surges. If you can like spread it out and be like more consistent in you know yeah natural the repetitive, the repetitive searches seem to work a lot better um so yeah that that I mean you can do it yourself and, and I was I mean I've, I've I've been doing this for a few years just my own agency um but now I just had to scale it a little bigger now yeah but it, yeah I re I really love these reports that that you've got with like local Falcon they just really show. I like the red to green, it's just so clear. Yeah. Um, yeah and then showing the client too. They're, they're like, I want to be, uh, even partners, like, I want to be all over, all over like that. I'm going to be like number one everywhere, all right, across the right. city. Um, cool. Uh, do you want to look at the question box with me? Let's see if uh, we got to jump off soon. But um, looks like Andrew Anderson said, Hey, what's the link for Map Movers? Um, I can throw it in the. I can, I'll, I'll throw it in the Facebook chat, I guess, right? That that would probably be better. Uh, but yeah, that that probably work. That way, if somebody watches the replay, they can just go find that thread instead of the uh, chat on here, which will kind of go away once we log off. Yeah, but again, I mean, you have to, have, you know, you want to have all your GMB ducks in order before you do it. And again, definitely, like, little tip is like. So it's, oh, go ahead. Like embed your. The Google, your clients Google My Business or your own on your website somewhere where it's optimized. I just I just pasted it in. Okay, cool. And yeah, I'm opening uh, it up again. I just Rodney said, "Hey guys, I've been uh, I've really been sitting on this for far too long. Thank you for your insight." Great. Uh, if you guys have any other questions, uh, Will and I will be on for a couple minutes. Uh, I'll put them in the chat box or in the uh, Fusion thread, where we see them. I didn't even notice my chat was up. But yeah, I think this one, this one here I was showing, this is a, oh no, this is a brick and mortar. Um, this one is a service area business, so it works, you know, it works for all of them. You have an Instagram, right, too? So, like, if somebody yeah, wanted to uh, say, hey, hey, client, uh, we have this this upgrade uh, yeah. we can put on your GMB. Um, do you have these new reports on your Instagram? These, like, uh, great no, yeah. ones? No, I noticed that I, I put a bunch up there, and um, for some reason it only came up as an image, not the animation, so that kind of stunk. So I had to take them all down. I got to figure that part out. I, I, can, I can help you with that. So um, Yeah. I couldn't get the anime. The it doesn't. Does Instagram not play a GIF? Uh, it has to be a MP4. Oh, okay. Well, uh, Rodney said, "Will I have to get PBNs?" Um, 
Oh, uh, it's probably t so talking about like starting out with with the fulfillment um, in Rainmaker. Uh, I would start with like collect service or uh, social links, guest posts, and then yeah. uh, PBNs are a bit more advanced. I probably wouldn't start with those. Yeah, yeah, Collette's, I, I, Collette's almost service is almost automatic for me for any client, like the social Viper. Yeah. Um, what I do is I, you know, if there's a business, um, I start with the, you know, money set. I don't know. Let's see. Um, like, I don't know. Let's see. Um, HVAC. So if this was my, um, trying to find an actual, I don't know why it's showing them in New Jersey. I'm just looking for any. I'll oh, we'll just use. We'll just use one of the ones in the in the map. So if um, like like this cooling unlimited, if that was my client, I would definitely send some somewhere on their website. But also, what I like to do on like another run is um, so that's cooling unlimited. It's called. I do like a brand search too. If I can write. I still messed it up, but it will, I'm sure it will fix it. My fingers are fat. So then I, I look at what they have, the other properties. Like okay. I'm always just trying to rank everything, right? So I hate Yelp, but I would I probably still would send like Viper links to it. Um, the Facebook page, you know, LinkedIn, like. I would look at what they have. I would take like an inventory of what they, they have and just um, run Viper links to those too because it all feeds back to the website anyway. Um, yeah. And then you, you just kind of, for keywords, you know, so, and um, you're just trying to, like, I'm always just trying to rank everything. Yeah, I, I, I would, focus on the GMB a lot. Uh, <laughs> just kind of like the, whatever, the tip of the sphere because that's where like 50, 60, 70% of the calls come through. People are just so... Exactly to like clicking the call link on that GMB and it's just right yep. there at the top and then it's like then you got your website underneath that and then yeah these other properties you're talking about like just yeah in there over time so you just take yeah, over then, if you are doing PBNs like if I'm doing PBNs for a local business um, you know I try to put as much you know one link to the website and then you know and then Google my business map um, the other thing um, I try to do even on the on a website is um, if we go to see photos. I think I've showed this before, but um, so these photos you can like if you're doing a WordPress, you can embed it, right? So if you just just uh, inspect, inspect, and then we look at the, it will give you right there. So it will give you the actual URL. Mm -hmm right here yep and then you can either embed those on wordpress or whatever you're using if you're doing wordpress um you know it's pretty easy you just type you just paste it in there i don't know what size this is two different sizes there so and i'm missing the uh h you take off the quote you know and then you can just use that that that's a smaller photo there's a bigger photo Plus you can kind of resize them. So that's the thumbnail and then this um, this one. This is the right one. Pat said, Cooling Unlimited shows not claimed. Is this normal? Uh, no, uh, it, should, it should be claimed. Um, it's like the first yeah, thing you do. Be, sometimes there's weird things with that, like it actually is claimed, but I know some of them, I'm not sure. <clears throat> if you were to claim it, it would probably like, show that it is claimed some some reason it, it some of them show that way i don't know why yeah this should be the bigger image like, oh, hey well yeah, would you yeah, happen to have uh would you happen to have a gmb we could uh, uh there's that embed code you showed me you were talking about it earlier where you you embed the map on oh, your I like could, contact page like where yeah, to find could, the embed code i could just that, use that be pretty, i could just use awesome. cooling unlimited too yeah if you okay. go Let's see. Let's go back here. Yeah. Um, I always do it from maps, so let me just 
I do maps.google.com because it's just easy to find. It's probably on there too, but um, yeah, this is really cool because instead of uh, what I was doing is just using like a widget or something. If it's Groove, there's a widget. If there's WordPress, there's widgets for it. And you like type the address in and it generates a map. But but this is like the actual Google. My the actual map. business. Yeah, yep. that's, yeah, instead of just typing in. Yeah, so like with Groove, you actually have to just do it, you know, use code. But it gives you the code. So like, yeah, it's being so slow. So it'll give you. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. So yeah, if you go share, and then embed a map, and then it just gives you the embed code right there. Awesome. Yeah, and I use that. I use those if I'm doing a PBN post. Um, you know, throw it in there. Um, yeah, really, any way you can. I mean, there, I know there are services where you can do like M, like map embeds. Um, I've found. I don't know, mixed results with those. I, I, I just like using my own properties and putting it on there. And what, what you showed um, me was uh, a week or two ago was you take this embed code, put it on the contact page as a map, like on your yeah. actual client's website uh, or yep. partner's website uh, <coughs> as a map. And then you like, I thought it was really neat. You showed, you showed me, hey, let's change the contact title to actually have the keyword in it as well. Uh, right, exactly. So Google will so say, page, hey, this map's embedded on a page that has a keyword in the title. Right. So, yeah. So the page title should be optimized too for a keyword. Um, you got to make sure you're not, you know, you don't want to duplicate titles, but something like that. And then also I'll put yep. like an A2 over it. You know, like when it's, you know, right above it, I'll put like another keyword, like, you know, how to find, you know, HVAC repair in, in Reading, something like that. Um, yeah, that's genius. Yeah. yeah, and it just looks, I mean, it looks normal, too. Like it, like on a PBN, it just kind of looks normal. Mm -hmm. um, my PBN that I build for, like, local businesses is a little different now, too. Like, I try to find more of, like, like um, geo-relevant PBNs, right? So, like, yeah. you know, if I'm working in Boston, I'll find a bunch of it doesn't have to be about HVAC or anything like that. It's more about Boston and kind of making it almost like a directory looking type of thing. Yeah, that makes you know, sense. You know, then possibilities of even um, generating some leads from there too. Yeah, that's that's uh, that's great. Uh, cool. Um, yeah, I don't see any other questions in the chat box. Um, you see anything in the thread? I think we'll start wrapping up since uh, Greg's going to use this yeah, webinar we'll for that. his office hours soon. Okay, awesome. Awesome, yeah. And if anyone ever has any questions, you can just message me. I love talking about this stuff. So I don't see any more comments. I have one comment, but my, my cool. computer is hanging out. Cool. Well, uh, this, was, this was fun, everybody. Um, and I think we'll be back in uh, two weeks for another acceleration webinar for Rainmaker. So awesome. Great. Cool. I'll see you guys later. Thank you. I'll talk Have a good day. Bye. Bye. You too. Bye.